Hey guys, it is me again and welcome back. This is going to be part two of the elevator tutorial for um, multiple floors. So, what we're going to do now is hook up, where is the side of this thing? Oh my god! Okay, <laughs> what we're going to do is we're going to hook up the side of this thing and put some buttons down. So, let's see if we get floor one, two, three, four. Okay, now I need some signs. I would like some signs. I don't remember where they are. One, two, three, four. Alright. Just, you know, labeling stuff, making stuffy. Oh, wow. Why do I want that? Floor one. Alright. Floor two. Alright. <sighs> floor three. And floor. Whoops. Oh, okay. Floor. Alright. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to put torches on the back of each so we can, you know. Did I just put them on? I put them on the signs. I am amazing. Alright, so... Uh, so, we're going to have to make it so that the rest of is coming off the side. I'm going to need some stone. Okay, I'm going to want... That'll be good for now. Yes. Okay. <laughs> and then we're going to want that. Put another torch, just for... Uh, I'm not going to stay as... as if. Wish I could speak. I'm always having trouble with that. All right, as I attacked as an inverter. So there's one, two. Uh, that's three, yeah. Three. Four. Okay. Now we have our inverters. Now we're gonna set up an RS Norlatch array. First off, I'm gonna put a repeater there stone and we're gonna start setting up the RS Norlatch array. So first off we're gonna put some torches here, 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 here and then some repeaters. Did I not place them on snow? I'm in the way. Okay. Dang it! Rage! Okay. Um, then a block, 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 block. Redstone on the back of these blocks. We're gonna want block there, block there, block there, block there, and there, and there, and there. Hmm, forgot that one almost. So now we're gonna put torch there, torch, torch, torch. All in the front of those blocks, lining up with each thing. Now, from here, we get to do something special. We get to put blocks along the top. Real special, right? And, whoops, didn't mean to put it over there. Bad. Okay, and then we break each one in between. So we get kind of this grid pattern there. Alright, from here, we're going to put a repeater there. And in between, right, each one. Alright, easy peasy. Now, uh, that's the next part. Just put a sand block on top of each of the inverted torches. Wait. To make things easy, let's hook it up first. So we got one there. I'm gonna take some redstone, put it into that one. Some more redstone, put it into. Whoops. Run it into uh, this one. And once again, some more redstone. Running it to uh, that one. Now, we gotta make each delay one tick higher than the reset. So that's one, so we're gonna set that two. This one will be three. Four, five, oh, five. Okay, so now, now we can put the sand blocks on top of the torches here. Why are we doing this? It's so we can reset the, uh, the current. Yeah, the electrical current each time. So we're just gonna go like that and run it into the back of that. So we'll just go like that. You gotta make sure it's on each of them. But you don't want it powered like that, so just put a block there to stop the, uh, I can't think of any words at the moment, to, uh, uh, restrict it, sure. <laughs> Alright, so now that that's done, I'll show you what, uh, this little system does. So, basically, if we hit floor one, oh, that, did I set that to two? Hmm. Maybe it'll be better to set it to... 
Yeah, maybe it'll be a better set it to three. Oddly enough. Mm, why though? I don't know. Okay, four one. Oh, never mind. I know why. Okay, see each of these blocks here. We gotta put redstone on the back of them, and can find that one. Then put redstone on the rest of the backs. All right. Yeah. Sorry, I completely forgot that. So this can go back to two now. Um. Alright, now, now I'll show you what it does. We hit floor one. Torch one lights up and stays on. If we hit floor two, same thing should happen, except for torch two. Same for three. And four. So, now that that works, and we know that, we're gonna hook up inverters on the back put torches well yeah inverters like I said and we're just gonna hook them up to the floors so floor one is right here and my circuitry just happened to work with this so basically uh, because mine's the only one that really has the tor inverted torches underneath it allows me the opportunity to hook in other signals so basically this block is always powered because of this torch and it only and this torch only lights up when this one turns off thereby pushing you out onto the next part of the uh, sorry, uh if the, up to the higher floors but if we keep a current to that it won't it'll make it, you stop at this point so basically you go up you go down but and then this torch won't light up so and then none of these will work because the current isn't being continued on. So, we just gotta hook these up. So this would be floor one, so we're gonna go like that and build a staircase. See, just like that. Now you don't have to build a staircase, you can uh, bring the signal up using vertical ascension, I mean uh, vertical transmission, but for simplicity's sake, I'm making a staircase. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Now it will be powered, but uh, that's because this block is being powered by that torch, thereby powering the redstone. It doesn't matter. It just just does that, but it's still that's the it's supposed to. <laughs> Ugh. I really do wish I could speak sometimes. All right, now we'll build another staircase up to the second floor, though. It only gets more complicated when you're uh, getting into the higher ones. Like, actually, it doesn't get more complicated. It just gets um, more aggravating. <laughs> oops, 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 oops. So, how much do I got here? I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Coolio. Okay. Now that one's hooked up, we just move on to the other floors. Okay. And I can't just go this way, can I? No, because if that one's on, it'll power the block. Here. That'd be, actually, it wouldn't be too bad, but still, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> We're just going to go. Wait a second. What is with this wiring? I'm an idiot. And that'll cut off the other one. Uh, Alright, so, I'm just going to move one out. There's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. It's not very long enough. 13, 14, 15, just check. Alright, I added room there for a repeater, so we're all good. If we just go like so. Repeater. There we go. 
And for the last one. Yeah, but like I said, this isn't as compact as you can get. I'm doing this for simplicity. You could also put them on top of the torches. Don't know why I didn't think of that. So let's do on top of the torch for this one. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, oops, ten, eleven, oh, oh. twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okie dokie. Now let's test it out, make sure it works. <sighs> Alright, let's see what we got here. Let's try three. Because three always seems to break for me, I don't know why. One, two, three. And look, we stopped. I don't have a diamond elevator. <gasps> yeah! Alright. Um. Let's go on to floor one and we'll just go up from there. I don't like that one. <laughs> Doop. And we're at two. And we'll finally move on to four. Two, three, four. All right. So it works. Um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and I'll see you guys later.